Hello. But now we're going to build the tree. We do see, I do seem to have some technical problems with the video at the moment, so please bear with me. we have another one of these uh, leafy parts like 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 using the uh, Jurassic World set I built recently Bear with me, this is one of these fun corner pieces where it has to be the right piece pieces. Otherwise you end up with the wrong colours. goes on here. This is obviously to make it a bit more tree like using the um, the brown and the green so which is quite nice. Now I'm looking for that's the one. This is part of the fire. Well, this will be part of the firing mechanism here, as you can see. This is as it's shaping up. Oh, missed the bit. One of these on the bottom. One of these goes on here. This is. going to be part of a tree so now this bit goes on here and it's looking that corner bit's looking quite good now we have the bits that make it more a little bit more tree like try to position this so so we can have the firing mechanism in there as well. mini roof a mini angled bit which goes in here yeah even we nearly lost a bit that would have been the first bit so we have a bit that goes on here Taking shape now, as we can, as you can see, and quite nice. Then we put, we got a little flower, flower bit that goes on here. We have another bit of foliage to go on first, though. I've got 
got the right shade there. We make, now we can make a little, put a little mushroom on it next. If there's room, bad joke, but There we go, we, we now need to have a tree stump corner, a mushroom and a plant of some kind which is trying to grow. We now have a part which let me see if I can find it. Bear with me, it's game of hunt the brick, there it is. Going blind in my old age. Make this bit goes on here to make make it a bit more tree like. I'll just put one of these bits across here. There we go, it's starting to look a lot more natural and tree-like. Harry just fell over, so... Well, we have another one of these woody or foresty bit to go on. Let's just try and find it. No, it's not it, so here. There we go. A bit of angled tree. Let's have a look, see which way this goes on. We have one of these plus a hook. This will connect a bit there. <laughs> Nearly. So Anyone hope anyone hope for me to lose a bit the third time it was guaranteed to happen on the third time. So that, that is a slightly different colour to enable to make the tree effect a bit more. Another Hold a bit, which is looking good, looking nice. It goes across there to hold it all in place. We have some more leafy bits to put on. A bit of foliage again. Now we have some bigger bits to put on. Looking a lot more plant-like. A couple more supporting pieces on here. Sorry, bear with me, I'm just trying to see if I can check my eyesight's not failing me. There we go. It was, I couldn't see for looking. 
have a another and I'm looking for a little roofing little roof bit. That's gonna be part of the spider so that can go over there. Oh another set of magic oh, I have found a spare set of magic wands as well. That's always handy. There we go, this is the bit I'm looking for. Try to make the tree a bit more. We're now gonna to come to a fun bit in a minute with this with the spiders. It's fun for some people and for some people it's for some people would call it creepy. So we've got to put a black spider on here. I do like spiders in Lego sets. They are quite cool. Please feel free to leave your opinion on on with on, on spiders on Lego spiders or spiders in general. Turn this bit round now and we put yeah, this bit here which is meant to be some foliage which goes on here like so and it gets reinforced in with a twig or could be Groot's arm even probably not quite yet because Harry Potter is still owned by Warner Brothers we now have a rather we now have the fire the piece that has the fires and it's quite quite a nice spider web effect. Could be could possibly be used in a in a, in a spider man set at some point which would be quite cool. Note to Lego. And and it also has a warning do not fire in people's eyes. There we go, we now have the tree already built we have spiders we have a back bit and we have we'll put that there for the time being I believe the next bit we'll be building will be the spider um, the spider agrogog I do apologize for my translation if I'm wrong so we have I think this will be his body or his head part I'm not sure I try not to get that close to spiders to find out really but this is probably one of these colour pieces that probably won't matter too much but it's still quite nice there we go that's the first bit some pieces which I haven't seen before which are quite nice these ones here I'll give you a closer look in a minute when I've got them attached these look like um, bits you attach legs or bits to right so that's definitely going to be the um, front part of the body we now have two of these oh I think I've just found another black spider happy days now we need two more of these these are these will be for the legs one of these and one of these and Hopefully I can find the other one. Yeah, 
there we go we have the potential for the spider's body with these eight eight legs you can attach sorry my fingers are oh, sorry if you can't see I do apologize if you can't see the whole thing so Make sure we've got the right way around. And we have got a couple more bits on here. Body's taking shape quite nicely. And I think I have a piece on wrong, but I haven't got a brick separator, which is going. To, this is going to be fun. I have to take this bit off and then pull this bit off. This is where having nails comes in handy. Nails and patience, so. And these bits go on here. Just checking I've got all the bits right because otherwise I'm pulling it all apart all again. So right now we have two of these bits. The spider's body is coming along quite nicely. There we go for what we have so far for the for his main body. Spider legs, spider legs. Nope, my eyesight is not failing me yet, so, and I haven't lost a brick, so. This is the now that's his body so far like that I believe it's a he but I'll call, if you if anyone, anyone actually knows and wishes to correct me do feel free my Harry Potter knowledge is not as good as it as it could be now stick this bit in here like so it's got a nice yellow stem as well which is quite nice, but I don't think it, make a, don't think it makes a lot of difference because the colour, you don't see the colour, but there we go, there's the front part of his part, front part of his body, so we'll put that down there for the time, but we'll put that down here because we don't, we don't want Harry to know what's coming, do we, so. Right, we are now, we are now building the I believe it'd be the abdomen, but the back bit, let's keep it simple. Some, someone can correct me later, so. Right, put that on there, put that on there. 
I can see which way this is shaping up now, but it's, which is quite, it's shaping up quite nicely though, so all is good. Right. There we go, this is what we have so far. Another one of these. We have a couple of blue bits which go on, should go on here. And they do fit, which is good news. Which these bits go on here to support these bits, which gives the the actual abdomen bit, as I call it. It's a nice round shape. Oh, nearly lost a bit. There we go. This is what we've got so far. And it's, that bit is going to attach to the body there, which which is going to enable. Looks like it enables some movement then. We have some nice colours in the middle here, but I'm not sure whether that's to grow a real spider's body or I don't know, but... But, but it does add to your Lego set when you, when you, need, some, when you, when you need some different colours. And there we go, we have the abdomen bit of the spider there, which we stick that on the back there like that. We have a body which is starting to is starting to look very arachnid like this should be a very good set to put with a spider-man set I do feel, I do think but we now have now this is where it's going to start to get interesting and fiddly this is a bit where I might actually lose some bricks and you could and I can see all the eye pieces now which is nice Now this bit goes on here like so. This is going to be his. Are they mandevils? I could be wrong. I could be right. But quite nice, quite nice nevertheless. So. Yeah, that bit goes on here like so. And we have a. Solid joining rivets, as I call them, the black ones, because the grey ones always seem to be are a bit looser. Now we have to build the other side. So try and do it by mirror image. Or follow the instructions. Whichever, whichever, whichever way works best for you. So. have some spider mandevils now bite 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 that's my no, I think I may have done these wrong better. That's better, that looks a bit more scary. See they'll be like that now, which is a lot more scary than the way I had them. So there we go, we have Agrigog has his mandibles now for whatever I believe they use for injecting poison or biting people or I just I I don't need to, I don't I don't think we need to worry about it too much so we now I'll have to put the put this bit on now. Let's 
black one of these. We have a See that bit goes. Oh, I see. Ah. Oh, very clever. That bit goes under there like that, and we make another one of these. All the bet, all the better for biting new wheels, as they would say. We are getting came close to losing a piece there, which would be quite entertaining. Oh, nearly. Oh, and again. See, I have done this bit wrong, so never mind. I have managed to put the wrong colour on, so Put that bit on there. We now he now is has a bit of bite to him. So I believe now we're doing his eyes. So has quite a few eyes which are quite nice spiders actually have eight eyes but I believe this model only seems to only only, accom only, only accommodates four but I could be wrong no nope, he only this particular spider only has four eyes There we go, the spidey is looking a bit creepy now, so tail is back, it comes up, so I think we're going to be attaching. Oh, now comes the fun part, spider putting the legs on the spider. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, and number eight to get these attached. Work out which spare bits I've left. I've fallen, I have forgotten to put on. No, 
see. It's going to be quite. There we have a spider. Quite a scary looking spider as well. So the legs, oh, the legs move out, which is nice. Give him a bit more stability. There we go. He can, he can now terrorise Harry Potter, and Harry Potter will, will, will work his magic and get rid of and scare him. We have he has he has his little spider cohort here and there is a firing mechanism which I will try and demonstrate now and they fire at Harry Potter now, this is a very good set got some very nice figures with it and overall it's, I do I, 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 would, I, would, I would probably rate it quite highly so well, and it's well worth it if you're a Harry Potter fan as well so if you like this video like subscribe share with your friends tell tell just 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 tell everyone. Thank you. Thank you for watching.